316 octovigintillion, 887 septinvigintillion, 646 sexvigintillion. Hi, thanks for checking out this video. So in this video, I'm gonna do a follow-up to my last video about how big is a Google. And if you have not seen that video yet, go check it out. I'll put a link to it right here. In my last video on how big is a Google, I left out a couple of things. First of all, I said there's no Google of anything in the world and gave an example using atoms. But a more clear definition of this is that there's no Google grains of sand in the world. Like think how small that is. The average grain of sand is only from 0.06 millimeters to two millimeters. And think of all the beaches, all the parks, and all the ocean and seabeds. The second thing I left out is that I stated how many years a million, billion, and trillion seconds are. But I left out how many years a Google seconds is. Well, recently when I was doing research for this video, I stumbled upon a website, Yahoo Answers. On this website, there is this great article on how many years a Google seconds is. I will put the link to this website in the video description, but back to this article. In this article, the person said that a Google seconds is 3.1688 times 10 to the 92nd power, and that is years. Also, there's no English name for this number because it is way too much to spell out. The closest I can get to a name would be to use Vigintillion, which is 10 to the 63rd power, and start from there. So a Vigintillion is 316 octovigintillion, 887 septinvigintillion, 646 sexvigintillion years. That is a ton of years. And that is just a Vigintillion. Imagine how many years a Google seconds would be. Hopefully after watching this video, you will have a better understanding of how big a Google really is. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, hit that like button and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.